sonorants and their formants guys sonorant sounds are um, also very interesting to be analyzed through uh, the features of prath uh, we know that the uh, sonorant sounds are uh, vowel like sounds and that's why they are called uh, sonorants because they have uh, sonority and sonority is actually the feature of vowels uh, vowels are the most sonorant sounds right and there are sounds uh, when you uh, look at them uh, look at their uh, spectrogram then you would uh, just feel like they are vowels right so we would explore uh, sonorant sounds and from uh, sonorants we are going to explore nasals and glides right uh, the lateral and those uh, trill and um uh, you know the taps they are also sonorants but we would explore only two while using the features of prath uh, nasal sounds and then uh, glide sounds um they are supposed to be vowel like how because they have a formants right but their formants are different and that we would discuss while uh, uh, taking spectrograms of them of those sounds and then uh, we would see that how the you know the uh, formants are lowered in what specific contexts and then um in contexts like uh, ama ana anga and uh, we and you right these are the specific contexts uh, for which we would explore these sonorant sounds and uh, we would also have a look on their uh, f1 as well as f2 and we would also try to have a look on f3 so that we can understand their correlates and their features and then we would compare them with vowels right and then we would try to observe that is there any uh, you know a structure any pattern which is systematically found within sonorant sounds so let's uh, record the nasal sounds first in the next session and then we would discuss them okay guys so we are recording our uh, sonorant sounds now and for that we would create a new file new file with the mono sound and this uh, mono sound is uh, required so let's go to the recording pan now so again we would make sure that the sampling frequency is on 44100 hertz and we are going to record uh, words for nasal sounds m n n g and then for glides w and y okay so i'm recording it a m a ana anga we you and i would save this to the list right so we would close it down and now we would see that how is our recording so we went at it and there is the sound ama ama ana ana right anga anga we we you you so these are our sonorant sounds and now we would explore the nasal sounds separately in our next session and then next to next we would discuss the glide sounds